We're back. We are back. Well, I'm back. Mom is back. And we do Night Lovell because I saw Night Lovell in Vienna. It was by accident, but it was a great show. And now we're off in a few hours to go to... Munich, Rolling Loud. So imagine, you can meet him too. Imagine your mom gets to see a Night Lovell show before you do. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and I had a ball. <laughs> obviously, love to mom. Support that. But deep inside, I was like, damn. <laughs> Go to my Insta to what get the, the hell? whole... Yeah. Why am I not there? What is happening? And that's why I'm driving eight hours so to get you there. Go to my Insta to see the whole story in description. We're doing Dark Light by Night Lavelle. This okay. is one of the songs that made him like blow up a little bit uh, back then. He has mentioned that he hates this song. That's oh. why I'm doing it, to rub it in. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, but he has said in uh, interviews, it's like, my fans love it. A lot of my fans came up with this one, so I'm still performing it. I don't know if he does it now. You maybe recognize it. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, that being said, it's off his album Concept Vague, which the title basically meant that the songs, a lot of the songs just didn't mean anything. It just sounded good. So yeah, there's a little insight for you. You ready? Okay. Classic underground song. Did you catch him in a white tee? Catch me overseas in a fucking white tee? He wasn't in a white tee. Uh, and Fake lyrics. After a few songs, he wasn't in a tee at all. Which you, I imagine, was a good thing? I was um, watching it backstage. I was on stage, actually. Long that was, was a stage. very privileged situation. Yeah. And I saw uh, DJ Shag. I was actually at the same height as the DJ. Shout out to the bodyguard, right? And shout out to the bodyguard. He was a huge help to me as well. All right. So I paused it here uh, for a couple of things. Yeah. Obviously, okay. the YT line kind of mm -hmm. overseas made sense. Uh, how do you feel about it so far? I can imagine that um, maybe uh, for him to still have to do this song, um, this is what made him blow up. And one and, of the yeah. yeah and maybe unintentionally i do get the fact that he uh the lyrics to me don't mean much and i get asked a lot being a mental health counselor uh, oh can you get into the lyrics and i said it just i think a few weeks ago not everything you have to go into and it's not always meant to be this deep mm -hmm. and i do believe this this wasn't meant that deep yeah uh, either so um for me it's kind of Weird to see this because I just saw the live show. I saw a different Did night with Al. I I think I don't know because I um I don't think so. Al although the sample does sound familiar. Okay, um, let's move on then. What do you think of the beat so far? Quickly. Uh, well, I like the new Night Lovell better. He, he produced this. So yeah, uh, but still, he was really young. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
basically fades out. I'll spare you the, because you already heard the beat. I'll spare you that one. All right. Old Night Lavelle. Uh, eight uh, years ago, the music <clears throat> video. And he's still really young, so he's really young at the time. Yeah. I do wonder, maybe I get the chance to ask him tomorrow um, if he would produce it now, if he would have done it differently. Um, I love his voice. I love the the beat of it. I love his flow. And like I said, he has progressed a lot. I've seen him on stage. The energy that guy has mm -hmm. is insane. Um, Used to be an athlete type. I so. was was with a friend and she. it was her first... A rap concert ever or listening to the music and uh, music I'm sorry and she um, didn't know his name and she would say the springer the jumper she would uh. call him the jumper the hopper that was so nice um, what I if I would have produced it right now I think the sample is is really there and I would have loved for it to be a little bit more to the background when he is oh uh, right rapping. yeah it's a, um, it's a vibey song I get it, but that's why I wonder if he would do it all over, if he even wants to, um, if he would do it the same. Yeah, again, one of his uh, more popular old songs, so I don't know. Same time, I get it, but at the, the other side, that's what brought him up. It's like, you kind of have to respect it. I, I get it that I respect artists... the fact that he's still performing it then for uh, his Well, we fans. don't know. Well, you would know, but you probably forgot. But, um, <laughs> we'll find out tomorrow. That being said, three, two, one. Six and a half. I have to be fair. Yeah. I'd say I prefer like songs like Alone or I Just Know Your Ways, which we both did in our first Night Level video. If you haven't seen, check that out. It's an old video, so older vibes, check out. Maybe we, we changed, you see something. Yeah, we um, did. Six and a half, Night Level. If Mr. Night Level is watching, Mr. Uh, Watch or Dance, um, tell us what song you think mom would like more. Hey. Yeah, I would love to know. And see you tomorrow. Same goes for you guys in the comments, by the way. Um, yeah. Take care. We'll see you then. Bye-bye. Be nice.